Alright guys, welcome to a quick review of the Pokemon Split Pad Pro. <laughs> so basically, I have this problem where when I play with my Nintendo Switch, my hands get tired and they cramp up because my hands are not super big, but I think they were not the size intended for the Nintendo Switch. So here's a demonstration of what I play. and. I don't know if you can tell, but when I'm here, just naturally, my hands would be like this. So go like that. This position here, it doesn't feel that good. And after a couple, let's say like maybe like an hour of playing, my hands start to cramp up. Obviously, there's the solution. You know, you take your pad off like this, you put them in here, click them in, and now I have no problem at all. This is great. This works for me. The only issue I have with this is that if I want to play in bed and you know just lay there I can't I don't want to have this on my knees or something it's it doesn't make sense which is where this comes in so I haven't opened this yet I haven't tried it yet I literally just got this probably two hours ago and I've just been waiting to open it up so we're gonna do that together this is pretty exciting and uh yeah your boy had to get the Pokemon Pikachu version. It was a little bit more expensive, but you know, it's not the end of the world. So let's unbox this. All right, so let's open this up. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and slice the sides off here. Let's open this up. Let's go like that. And let's get this out. Here's the big reveal. Oh, I had them upside down. Leave this corner and ooh, these look nice I love them oh these feel really nice like these are like this fits in my hand just like this this is great oh yeah this this feels amazing like I could this feels amazing wow and the buttons feel good beautiful clicks um, yeah I mean this isn't an official Nintendo thing so I expect this to work just as good as anything else um, let's, let's test them out. Let's put them on the switch and see how they feel. So this is very exciting. And, uh, oh, the switch is upside down. What are you doing? I'm trying to make a video. Nice. Babe, feel how good Are you these... live or no? No, 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 I'm just recording. Wait, did someone say live streaming? My goodness, this is the perfect time to plug in my own stream. If you want to see more gaming stuff, come on down so it's super easy it's twitch.tv slash only fam ollie or as people always mispronounce it but it kind of works and it sounds kind of quirky and i kind of like it only fam ollie guys you have to come check out the stream i know you have the time it's sick it's fun and the community is chef kiss so hop on down i'm not going to put any clips in this one because it's not about me today but about the switch but guys, you have to come into the stream. Twitch.tv slash OnlyFamOli or OnlyFamOli. Okay, I'll see you guys then. Oh my god. That's ridiculous. It's, it's ridiculously big. It's so big. <laughs> it really is. But feel it. Feel how good that feels. Or is it too big for you? That one's good. Like, no, it, it feels really nice, right? Yeah, it feels amazing. It's huge though. You heard it, guys. It feels like amazing. it's huge. Hey, get out of here. This is going to be... PG-13 video. Maybe I'll leave that in at the end. Okay, so let's talk about some pros and some cons. Let's start with the bad. So there's no gyroscope on this. Um, you can't aim by turning the machine around. It's not a deal breaker, but I kind of wish I knew that before I bought this. Once again, I'm playing Pokemon, not like a first player shooter, so it's really not the end of the world. That was a con, let's go for pro. Uh, it is really comfortable. If I haven't made that super obvious in the uh, video so far, it's like super duper comfortable. Uh, there's a bunch of programmable buttons. I haven't done it yet because I've only had it for like two days. And uh, yeah, so that's really, really cool. And I mean, obviously the design's really cool. Something I find really cool, and this is kind of like a little shout out to whoever invented this, or Nintendo. Uh, there's a button in the back that you can use your hands and you can like the way you hold it and you pull on it as you can see here, kind of like in the back, um, is very intuitive, so you have to program it, but I think it's a really cool button to add to the game. So that's a pro. 
Um, all in all, I'm gonna be using this on my vacation. I will be on an eight hour flight. And uh, yeah, so I will be able to kind of do like a follow up on them. And I guess I'll write in the comments if I'm like, yeah, this is a horrible product, something bad happened, I'll put it in the comments. But as of now, with a couple hours of use in it, I like it. I think it's good. And uh, it's a Nintendo official product. You know, you got the Pikachu. All in all, I'm gonna give this 4.5 stars. And the 0.5 is only because it doesn't have a gyroscope and they don't tell you on the box. And I feel, I feel it's slightly misleading, but I could have also just done my research. Lucky for you, I was the, the test dummy. So if you need a gyroscope, don't get this. If you want a cool design and a super comfortable uh, new controller for big hands like me, this is your guy. Guys, this has been an only Famoli tech video. And uh, once again, come to the stream, twitch.tv slash only fam all. Guys, I'm telling you, I don't make YouTube videos anymore because Twitch is so much fun. Guys gotta come. That being said, have a great day. Love you all. Bye bye. You know, I'm 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 literally trying to make a review app. Gus, you wanna play some Nintendo Switch? You wanna play some Nintendo Switch? <laughs> You yes. want to play some Nintendo Switch? Yes.